Thunder coming off of two wins, one against Denver, one against Memphis. And we are set to go. It is Chet Holmgren, and he gets his who box in the Thunder win, the opening tip, and away we go. Thunder played really well against Memphis as, once again, Zubac just hanging around the restricted area. Had no interest whatsoever in defending that shot. The 19th, so a lot of opportunities to be pumping in votes for the Thunder. As, of course, SGA was an all-star a season ago, rightfully. He's a clean one. Paul George checks the shot clock. Desperation shot, got it up over J-Dub, but it was contested. That's terrific. One of the reasons why the Thunder built out a double-digit lead. Well, he's making him pay the price for the slow rotation, rotation coming out of here. As Harden loses the basketball again. As Harden loses the basketball again. Got away with a shove. On man rush. Four on one. And Paul George punched it away from Holmgren. There's SGA and behind the back pass from Vasquez. And he finishes it off. 42% from deep on the year, and it looks like SGA pinballing his way right through the seams of the Clippers' defense. Thunder off to a great start, controlling the tempo. We talked about that, pushing the pace. One out of two at the line for SGA. Laying out the challenge tonight against this L.A. Clippers team that is undefeated in the month of December. Not off to a slow start initially on the acquisition of James Harden. There's a nice move on the drive from SGA finishing it off. Six straight on November 1st. It's nine consecutive wins for the Clippers. Or one of the many good teams in the Western Conference. Coming in with a nine-game win streak. Jay, nice hesitation, plus the ball fake. Got all those Clippers up in the air. Norman Powell off the bench for L.A. One of the top bench producers in the league. Shea knocked off his spot, still tried to get the shot off. Just said, look, man, this is a track meet. You know, almost like you're being chased by a grizzly bear. It's straight speed. It's straight speed. Make or miss. I'm sorry, partner. I couldn't think of any other thing to say. Austin's three is no good. There's SGA helping out on the rebound. Since it's the most engaged he's ever been. Wide open. The parting of the seas for Josh Giddy, whose hot first quarter continues. Makes his move. Here's the physicality. They tried to get the foul call. Didn't get it. There's SGA with a block. Third effort by Harden. And finally it's blocked. Some real frenetic possessions. Westbrook dumps it inside. SGA this time with a block and another putback. Hopefully. Yeah, here's that high ball screen coming again. Zubats outside. Coffee. No. Really cool stuff. Two global stars becoming good friends. And right out of the timeout, Isaiah Joe once again rips the cords from three. And you know the acquisition of Harden has added to it, you know those types of numbers. Oh, and Norman Powell with some defense on SGA getting up there. Thunder have led by as many as 14. Harden making his move on the rookie, and this time the Thunder stripping away with a turnover. And a good defense that time. Just better offense by Paul George. Try to get the ball out of the hands. SGA real soon, and that's what you want to do. <laughs> Harden had it taken away on the turnover. Wallace up ahead, dishes it off. Wiggins in transition, and the Harden turnover leads to the easy two. We're all happy. And there is Jalen Williams defending hey. Paul George, and immediately it's George on the turnaround, no good. Good news to see Jalen Williams has returned after turning that ankle early in this quarter. Didn't miss a ton of time. SGA has been quiet offensively. Not that time on that beautiful turnaround rainbow shot that he got up over Coffee. That solid ball movement just continues to pay dividends. And now a turnover by Tyson Harden. Two on one. SGA blows right by him. Easy flush and transition. And SGA trying to make it 13-0 and push the lead. Back up to 12. Oh, he's a added addition as the season started for them. Great pickup as well. And Shea on the step back shot had a little bit of space. And it's Isaiah Joe. He collects the offensive rebound. SGA drives in, little sidestep on Westbrook. SGA, sweet move, sweet finish. And, and how about picking up that loose change off the floor? You see what happened, folks? That's buckets. Jay, think it's going to be an and one. It's going to be on the floor. Still waiting for the ruling here from Bill Kennedy. 
so it is on the deck. SGA is at the free throw line, and now a quick word from Academy Sports and Outdoors. Fires it cross court, but there's SGA saving the possession. Leads up to Kenrich Williams, and SGA perfectly in the right place as the Thunder almost turned it over. Three seconds to work with. Holmgren catches, gives it up. SGA is going to get fouled by Westbrook. Boy, the Thunder pulled that one out of their pocket. Well, that, that was a design play, too, Michael. You have to give the Thunder credit. That wasn't anything that they just in, improv with three seconds left to close out the quarter. That's something that they practiced and run because it obviously was that high pass to Chet with the trail from SGA. They had three seconds to work with. Now for the rebound. You see the volleyball tips, and it ends up in the hands of Wiggins. Shea, once again, this time he squeezes his way right to the cup. Shea surveys that Clippers defense. Looking to get to his spot. Love's going left that time. He got it to go. Right over Tice. It's tough to do, you know, in the you know, in the heat of the moment, in all fairness. And because there was no imminent possession, that means it's a jump ball at center court, and a jump ball that is won by Chet Holmgren over the top of Tice. His most recent group. Boston Tice, Highland Brown, and Shea. His way in the lane, but lost it out of bounds. Couldn't really get a whole lot of leverage off that scoreboard. So that, that deficit still sitting at 17. Oh, Shea just punched it away from Tice. Now he's got the step, and Tice. Oh, Shea just punched it away from Tice. Now he's got the step, and Tice tried to block it on the back end, but Shea still able to put it down, and he thought he got fouled. But it was all OKC tonight, with the exception of just a brief moment in this game where the Clippers took a lead in the third quarter. The Thunder led by double digits in the first half.